Last summer and autumn, I was getting loads of phone calls and messages from people who have got wild bumblebees nesting in their gardens or sheds. They were asking questions like, are they going to sting me? Can I move the nest? Are they going to stay here forever? So I thought I'd make this short video explaining why there's absolutely nothing to worry about. Bumblebees are like the teddy bears of the bee species. They're not aggressive, they don't swarm, and they're really not interested in hurting you at all. If one does fly a little bit too close, all they're doing is checking you out for pollen and nectar. A queen bumblebee wakes up from hibernation sometime in the early spring, and she'll be starving. One of the first things she'll do after finding some food is to look for a nest somewhere dry, safe and cosy. She'll lay a few eggs and keep them warm until the first of the worker bees hatch. They'll lay some eggs, look after the nest and go out foraging for food. Then later in the summer they'll produce some male bees and they'll go out to mate and help produce the next year queens. Bumblebee nests only last between two and six months and all the bees will be gone by the autumn, except the queen, but she'll be settling down into hibernation until next spring. So please don't move them or even worse, try to kill them. I promise, bumblebees don't want to hurt you. Unless you sit on one or deliberately try to hurt it, they're not going to sting you. They just want to go out foraging in your flowers. I love wild bumblebees and my own honeybees. If you'd like to find out more about the wild bumblebees, I've answered some of the most commonly asked questions down in the video description.